Amen. So look, Ronnie 2K made it. About 2K mocap. So you know that they, they start and they roll out. They done already done other things. Y'all check out my other 2K25 videos. And I'm I'm just a little confused. I thought Pro Play ended all of this. Besides like cutscenes and all that. So then I go on Twitter and Jumpman Germ also tweeted this out. We're gonna see what the community has to say about 2K25 if they're hyped for it. Some people are even exposing Pro Play. We're also gonna talk about the 2K25 body types and the 2k25 lethal drills within this video man it's a lot of talk you know in the community about these things but yeah y'all make sure y'all drop a like it's free hit the like button so look what i firstly want to say is this shady guy right he tweets out well if it's anything like prior sessions it looks like i'll have my work cut out for me again next year also if pro play can take game footage and turn it into animations why are they still doing motion capture to begin with mm. now look at the picture this is shady this is him then he showed luca right then he says 2k mocap so he's, he's exposed he's exposing the pro play <laughs> It's pro play against YouTube? Now me personally, bro, I know that pro play is literally a marketing ploy. It is against Jutsu. Anyone that does any type of raving about pro play or how great pro play is, how it enhanced the gameplay and how it's so realistic, they are NPC, they have sold out or they just don't understand the game or they're extremely ignorant or they're a sellout, okay? <laughs> And also, they don't understand the gameplay at all on, like, any level. Because it's, it's just a marketing ploy, bro. You can go check the previous years, and you can see the animations still look the same. You feel me? The animations been looking the same since 14. You know, it's just, it's just there's more smoothness in previous years, and there's not as many hitches and load-ups and, you know, like they are now. So it's like, how is it more realistic now? Just because you can see Paul George do the move on the game and it look like the same way he's doing it in real life, that don't mean that in another 2K, it don't look just like that, just like it does in real life. They've been trying to mimic real life for years, since the beginning. So how now the pro play, it just it doesn't make sense. And then wouldn't mocap be more realistic than a camera scanning something? <laughs> now let's see what everyone has to say about this because on the YouTube, people always like to say that casuals like the game. And okay, better fix ant, ant. A lot of people want ant. Give more animations. Hey, all them animations and everything they added, completely useless um there's only a few animations especially this year because of all the nerfing that they did to the dribbling and the gameplay you you might not know this if you know you're just playing npcs all day but in the advanced world if you want to get by a good 2k player and not just someone that's way worse than you there's very few animations compared to previous 2ks because they have so many hitches and load ups and only certain animations have less hitches and less load up so then it forces you to use certain animations more than anything because there's a lot of animations that you can't run out of you can't get a quick first step out of and that you can't get smooth sequences like you could before um that's very unrealistic but uh yeah let's see even more animations to make the game unresponsive i thought pro play made this obsolete Oh, we got a can't wait for this game. Let's go. Need auction house back. Don't buy 2K25. I hate this company with all my well-being. I can guarantee you all these guys are negative win percents. Do or die for 2K. Boycott 2K25. A, but, you know. Fix 100 overalls. How does Ronnie2K still have a job? F you, Ronnie2K. Was pro play not meant to eliminate the need for this? Let's see. Cut scenes and emotes. They be copying the same emotes, though. I gotta be smarter than this. Yeah, I, I said the cut scenes. Another gimmick. Pro play was fake. It definitely is, guys. 
y'all can listen, listen. I know y'all be thinking I just be talking, guys. I am like, I'm the 2K Messiah, guys. I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm the only one with the original 2K Bible. Anyone y'all hear pumping up that pro play, they are a fraud. Okay? Every, every real 2K player knows that hoe is a marketing ploy, bro. Fix Edward's face. This dude's tired. Fire Ronnie. I can't even get hype for 2K anymore. This you know he a negative win percent. Change the engine. Hey, he real. He knows, bro. It's the engine, dog. I'm telling you, bro. Change the presentation. Change the gameplay mechanics. <laughs> he knows. He's not one of these uh late bloomers, man. On the 2K scene. Change the monetization. Change the city. What? He knows. This a casual. The casual knows. Happen to pro play. They need to mocap them damn graphics. Damn. KY Jelly. Oh, we got a positive guy right here. Now, Joey tweets out, please, for the love of Jesus, on NBA 2K25, just let us pick our body type in the builder. But if we want to change it to a different one afterwards, we can by doing workouts for it. This is a brilliant idea. W, Joey 2K, okay? Listen, I don't know about y'all. I hate doing workouts every week. It's very annoying. Y'all let me know y'all's thoughts down below. I hate doing it, bro, and you got to do it for every build. I know they do that because they want our hours on the game so they can sell them numbers to Gatorade or whoever whatever investors or ad whatever they that's why they do little dumb stuff you got to keep getting on every week imagine you got six different builds you got to keep doing the get bro imagine the time you know they they trying to clock that hoe but that it makes users very annoyed like i don't i don't think they understand bro but um and the body type thing this is the worst they 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 made it to be bro i just want to pick my body type I miss having a burly damn point guard and all that. I don't think it broke the game or nothing. Y'all let me know how y'all think. Everybody's just skinny and nobody wants to wait a month or two months. And then you got to do that for every build. It's it's corny, bro. Like, I'm not not invested. Y'all let me know if y'all liked it. I, I hated how they did the body type thing this year. I hope they change it. But I like what Joey says right here. He says, let us pick our body type. Then if we want to change it afterwards, we could do workouts for it. That's a great idea. W. Joey. W. Joey. Now, Dime says something about the Lethal Shooter Gym. Now, y'all let me know how y'all feel about the Lethal Shooter Gym. This is extremely annoying, bro. Oh, my God, bro. One of the most annoying things in 2K. It's so... Bro. <laughs> it's so annoying. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about it down below. Okay, I just want to play the game. I hate doing all this stuff, but I want my purple hot zones every Monday. I got to go do it and I got all these different builds. I'm not just going to use the same build. I got to go do it. I don't care if it take two, three minutes. It's annoying running there through the lag and then having to do it. It's just annoying. I don't like it. I want them to remove it, but they're probably not. It's another way to get us to clock in more time. In hours and uh y'all let me know it's just things like that that make you like really annoyed with 2k y'all let me know how y'all feel about it um but then he says lethal shooter gem should evolve in 2k25 to more than just a hot zone workout <laughs> he want that oh more <laughs> i'll be agreeing with dime on mo most of uh everything 2k man imagine if they had actual shooting drills <laughs> that you could just do repeatedly on whatever difficulty you like. You don't have to earn VC or progress from it as you already have that in the team workout, but just something you could use to actually get better. Bring back the full court, half court, one-on-one -on -one personal workouts with the NBA players too. Just bring back my court, bro. You know, here, here's how I feel about it. I feel like they, uh, they made, uh, they took away my court so they could make us all go to gatorade to test our moves and our jump shot and all that which is very annoying it's always be broken it's laggy you gotta walk to it it's <laughs> we
we can't do our my court. I think it's cause, cause they're trying to like show like, oh look, Gatorade, like you know, and they getting them money. I don't know. I could be wrong, but I think they're doing that to try to like force numbers a certain way and like you know be like, look, there's some people be having the Gatorade gym and. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I, I don't know, but I think it's just lame. Just bring back my court, dog. Like, th this is what I mean about 2K, right? This is something. Who was saying they didn't want my court anymore, right? They just change it. They take stuff out. They do what they want, right? You feel me? And that hoe is corny, my boy. Everyone, every year since they took out my court, we've been saying we want it back. They not listening, dog. It's it's little simple. Look, bring back my core. Please stop adding more features and just work on the core gameplay slash AI. I watched a jump shooting video that showed from like 2K7 to now, and it's the same stuttery motion since like 2K16. Could just bring back my courts, but they insist on us shooting in the lag. Gatorade. Hey, y'all go watch my last rec video. It was hilarious, man. Click the video on the screen. Make sure y'all subscribe. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here, here we go again. People talking this for when this hit the fan. Everything I'm that made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome. dome.